Hey everybody, it's that time of week again for the thrift shop find of the week. Setting before you is a collection of PlayStation games, PlayStation 2 games, GameCube games, and one handheld Monopoly slot machine, all for the low price of 21 bucks. Welcome back, flea market and thrift shop. What we're looking at today is a small collection of video games and one handheld slot machine that we got for a really good price. Starting out here is for 99 cents, you can see right here on the card, and you see that it works too. Is a Monopoly slot machine in really good condition with the instructions in the back and the uh, battery cover, which is in place, which is kind of hard to find. It's rare to find at the thrift stores, stores and the flea markets that the battery cover is actually in place. Okay, next we'll start out with the PlayStation, original PlayStation games we got. Delta Force, Urban Warfare. Case is in really good condition. So is the CD. For two bucks, not a bad find. Up next, Kurt Warner's Arena Football Unleashed. Again, another original PlayStation game in its original case with the manual and disc. Now we usually don't pick up sports titles because they're so plentiful, uh, but this one we hadn't heard of really and thought it was a little bit unique. It wasn't an EA game or anything like that, so we thought, why not? We'll add it to the collection. Moving on to the PlayStation 2 finds, we got a pinball, Hall of Fame, original case, instructions, game, Great price. Dragon Ball Z Budokai 2. This one's heavy. You can actually feel. It's got a little bit more wear in it, but it's a Dragon Ball Z game, so it's really cool. Original manual, original game. Again, for $2. Champions of Norwith. Now, it is the greatest hits, and we really like to try to get the original black bordered ones. But something like this, we really couldn't, really couldn't pass up for two dollars, which explains why it doesn't have the manual, but we still bought it. And favorite one, great find, very excited about greatest hits, Star Wars Battlefront Two. This is one of the best Star Wars games ever. It's got the original manual, original disc. Again, it is a greatest hits, but it's Star Wars and it's Battlefront 2. Well worth the price. Now we're going to move on to the GameCube games. And we're going to start out with Shadow the Hedgehog. Sega game. Um, this one did not have the manual with it, but it does have the disc, and we really try to pick up GameCube games, really no matter what their condition, just because they're GameCube and they're harder to find. Next one is Beyblades V-Force, again, Nintendo GameCube, no manual, but a disc in great shape for $2.00. Can't beat that to add to the collection. Next one, GameCube Sonic Riders. This one we were fortunate enough to have all the inserts, including the manual and whatnot, and the game, all in the original case. A little rough, but for $2, can't beat that. And Nintendo GameCube, WW Crush Hour. It's neat. It looks like it combines wrestling with racing. That one might be fun. Sort of like a crazy taxi. This one's got the manual, the inserts, and the game. So there it is, folks. Going back, we got a small collection of original PlayStation, PlayStation 2, GameCube games, and a handheld Monopoly slot machine, all for 21 bucks. Check out your local thrift stores. You'll never know what you'll find. If you like what you saw, please subscribe. As always, comments are welcome below. 
Leave us a list of your favorite games and favorite titles. Think back to the ones that brought you joy and the ones that you would play again today. Thanks for watching.